Well, let's talk group sets and let's talk Campagnolo. Now, Campagnolo have been pretty quiet with their group sets over the last four years. They have bought it their e-car one-by system, which has been claimed to be a really nice one-by and works extremely well. But on the roadside, it's been about four years since we've seen the 12-speed come out. And Campagnolo now in 2022, a little bit behind the eight ball because the two other major manufacturers, SRAM and Shimano, have now gone to wireless connections between the brake levers and the rear part of the system. So let's have a bit of a talk about what Campagnolo might be doing and what they might be bringing out in 2022 to do that catch up. Well, Camp Agnolo have a bit of unusual setup in their, their product line from their Super Record down to their Chorus, which is their three top tier group sets. Now, SRAM are giving their top three group sets all electronic, but Camp Agnolo are not doing that. They're only offering the electronic group set in the Super Record. They used to offer it down to Chorus, but they discontinued that idea. So now what we have is Super Record, is EPS and then we have record which is mechanical and chorus it's mechanical so unless you want to pay that really hefty price for super record if you're in the Campanola Ecoskiss system you can't access the EPS system so I think that Campanola has to have a real think about their product line because not only are they not offering electronic group sets down to their mid-tier they also have a wired system and the old style junction box that still needs to be connected somewhere, usually underneath your stem, which is not compatible with a lot of the newer bike frames and integrated systems that are coming out on the market. Now Campagnolo have got a few tricks up their sleeve and I think that they're going to come out in 2022 with a really big bang and I think they've been working on some stuff in the background behind the scenes and we're going to see some significant upgrades with the Camp Campagnolo Road group sets and what I predict that they're going to do is first they're going to change the way that their EPS wired system is they're going to have to change that, at least get rid of that junction box. So even if they stay to a wired system, they're going to have to move that functionality that's in that box and the charging port to somewhere else, either to the front mech or to the brake lever or to the rear derailleur. So the integration that's coming on a lot of the bikes, you don't have somewhere where you need to put this box that's going to make the whole integration look ugly and destroy the whole effect of it. So they, number one are going to get rid of that junction box and they'll probably go to some sort of wireless system maybe something similar to shimano that's a wired rear system but has a wireless system connecting to that and what i think they might actually do is make it a 13 speed because i've already got the 13 speed developed on the e-car so all they would need to do is change the parallelogram so it doesn't have to work with such a big cassette or difference of ratios and then they can just put that on. Of course, they need to also develop the electronic system to work with that, but they may come out first with a mechanical system, which is a 13 speed, and then what they'll do is, is they will, as they normally do historically, then later on or six months later or a year later, bring out their electronic group set. So I think Campanolo have some real tricks that they're going to bring up our sleeve. And once again, leapfrog the other brands when it comes to the amount of cogs you have out the back. Well, I think Campagnolo are going to be making a quite huge change to their model lineup. They'll probably still call them the same, you know, they'll super record, record and chorus, but 
the way it is at the moment, they're only offering the EPS at the super record level and the record and chorus can only be bought in mechanical and I think what they're going to have to do is offer the EPS down to the chorus models because the other brands are doing so and it's speculated that Shimano 105 are going to be offer electronic groups as well because a lot of people are asking for it, the, the customers are demanding it and for Campanolio to keep their foot in the door and have a component at different price points to combat that or compete with that they're going to have to offer those group sets down to those lower levels so I think what we're going to see we're going to see a really big shake up in the Campinolo group set we're also going to get a 13 speed we're going to get a complete model revamp and we're also going to get a fully wireless or semi wireless system So from Camp Agnolia, we've got a lot to really look forward to and I think it's exciting times for Camp Agnolia. We're going to potentially get a 13 speed because I think that to Camp Agnolia to, to grab that off the e-car and put it onto their road group sets is not going to be that difficult and also the only negative to that is it's a different free hub so that is something that uh, will have to be taken into consideration but the other brands are already done that so I don't think people will be too upset if Campanolo goes to a different free hub. Then we have the group set range. I do think we're going to have a massive overhaul of the group set range and the fact that Campanolo only offer electronic group set at their top tier super record group set that will have to change just for them to stay competitive so that's something that's going to be really nice to look forward to we'll be able to buy chorus with a EPS system or at least a record of an EPS system like they used to have years ago and we're also probably going to see well I would probably say pretty certain we're going to see some redesign to the way that the communications done between the brake levers and the derailleurs at the back of the bike we're going to see something like SRAM or Shimano coming forward so it's exciting times in 2022 and I think because the product cycle is every four years and it's been four years since the 12 speed was first released 2022 is going to be pretty much a good target for these new technologies to be rolled out. Well, anyway, guys, leave your comments down below. What do you think is going to happen in 2022 with Kemp Dolo? And I will see you next vid.